Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. <laughs> Let me cough. <coughs> I'm, I'm a little bit sick, guys, but why do people do this to themselves, bro? Why do people do this, fam? Like, opening up a can of worms like this, G. Remember when I made a video, right, on uh, Beyonce? Well, it was a girl, right? She tweeted saying, oh, Beyonce is bigger than Ronaldo and Messi in football. And, like, the replies, right, to her tweet, fam, her just absolutely getting cooked. That that thing actually went viral, bro. Like, it actually went viral. It was, like, on the shade room and stuff like that. It was, it was a funny video, guys. Please go check it out if you've not seen it, right? But another similar, uh, another similar thing is happening again right now on Twitter. Music... <laughs> music fans versus football fans right so this girl right she's come out and said like sports will, will, will never be like as, as big as music bro she came after every sport bro nba fans <laughs> football fans usc fans f1 fans nfl fans tennis fans cricket fans everybody bro and the replies to her tweet right she got cooked fam she she actually got cooked bro like this tweet's gone literally like what 22 million views right now and it's only uh, came out what like a day ago <laughs> bro it's crazy but i am gonna be focusing on, on the football re related tweet guys so yeah grab a cup of tea just like i have and yeah just sit back and just enjoy the roasting and the cooking of this absolute moron yes i will call her moron because she's a moron but anyway let's go right into it so the tweet right, i do have a little bit of, of, of a story guys so this tweet says sports will never be as important as a Sports will never be as important as music or any other art. Everyone can run and kick balls. A few can write and produce songs. Being creative and expressing yourself is something no football player can do successfully and win awards for that, bro. And she continues. You didn't even stop. You didn't even stop, right? She, and then she says, they they going to start crying again with their misogynistic asses, bro. And when I seen that word, right, I was like, why do people throw this like, the word misogyny around, fam? Like, they don't understand. Like, especially, it's like kids who are like, under 23, 24, right? They always throw this word misogyny around. I'm like, you guys don't understand what it means. Like, first of all, research the word, right? And then use it correctly because it's a, it's a really powerful word, guys. It's a really powerful word. Anyway, <laughs> this person right has anti-hero has rebutted back and says name one art name one artist that could do this right and it's four million people in a city of Buenos Aires because Argentina just won the World Cup a few days ago right and they're still partying now it's Friday the twenty third of December right they won the World Cup on a Sunday last week and they're still partying now bro for the last like six days these guys have been partying bro you know what I mean it's four million people you know how hard it is right to bring together four million people people at one certain time from just coming together or over the state over a similar thing g it's hard and this 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 right it's like people from different backgrounds as well you know like it's a a um a, a, a plumber it's a lawyer bro you get what i mean like it's, it's someone who works in kfc it's just different people from different backgrounds coming together because their country right just won a world cup fam that that this is one of the most prestigious trophies you can win any in, in in any realm right of an endeavor sport the uh, music fam the bro anything fam like the world cup especially winning world cup bro like it's it's so difficult as well like the, the amount of skill that needs be done to do that g and the thing is too yeah even when i live in england like england here like in a quarterfinal right whenever england win like in a quarterfinal and they beat like tunisia g you've got people on the street in manchester just partying coming together bro in the name of sport fam can taylor swift do this nonsense bro can take can taylor swift right come together and bring four million people in one city like okay let's say taylor swift lives in la fam do you think she can bring four million people together in the city of la for them just party most of the people don't even like taylor swift fam <laughs> you get what i mean bro like this is it's absolutely nuts bro like it's crazy g and it's it's not just again like it's not even like in Buenos Aires, argentina it's, it's it's in rosario argentina where let's say there's like what 1.4 million people living there and they're out there on the streets partying for six days straight g it's this it's not bro like i love music bro i listen to music all the time g kendrick lamar j cole asap rocky drake g like so many music artists right but they can't do this bro they cannot four million bro <laughs> they grab it bro four million people that's the, the gravity of that is absolutely insane fam like four million people g anyway they, <laughs> she rebuttals again and says taylor right and she posts a picture and, it, and and the picture's got a statement um 
on it and it says Taylor Swift releases um, statement regarding the Ticketmaster sale of her Eras tour. It's truly amazing that 2.4 million people got tickets, but it really pisses me off uh, that a, a lot of them feel like they went through several bear, uh, 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 bear attacks to get them right. And I'll, I'll come back with this. 2.4 million, right? It's not just one city, bro. It's around the world, fam. It's all around the world because she's doing a tour. She's touring, right? So she'll be in, in different countries, basically. So she'll be in, like, um, Paris, Milan, London. She'll be in Madrid, Barcelona. And then she be, might be in New York. And she might be in Sydney, Australia, right? And this is 2.4 million, right? People all around the world. With the Argentina celebration, it's 4 million people in Buenos Aires, the city of Argentina. 4 million people. If she went to, let's say, Cinder, right, to the, uh, to the opera house, I, I don't know if that's actually like a, an arena, right, right? Or like to a, a, like an indoor arena in Cinder, right? And that sits about 30,000 people, fam. The, that's the most that's that's the most she can do bro 30, 30k people she ain't rounding up 4 million people in the city of in the city of sydney fam no way bro no way g anyway <laughs> she continues again right and she says one of the two requires being smart and trust me it's not football fam she's never played football in entire life bro she's never had to, to switch a ball right she's never had to um uh, fight against the press, not to even break down a a low block, fam. No, she, bro, bro, she don't know about the playmakers, Zidane, fam. She don't know about the post goals, the Javis, the Iniestas, the Modric, the Tony Cruz's, bro. Don't know about the Messi's, fam. They're like, bro, don't know about that, bro. Like football, right? The best football players, if you look at them, they they are the smartest ones, G. That's that's happened with Wayne Rooney, you know, but <laughs> you don't talk about Wayne Rooney, but when you look at like Maradona, how he played football, fam. I just did a video on Maradona like a week ago or him in the 1986 World Cup killing it absolutely killing it by himself bro like the technique again the imagination that this guy had to use right to put balls through and assist people bro like they, they, they don't get this fam I don't get this bro I don't get this bro I'm telling you G anyway <laughs> this person says can Taylor Swift do it <laughs> on a cold running night in Stoke no she can't I mean, not her she can't do it fam no fam I'm telling you bro in a cold running night in Stoke is <laughs> that especially like the Stoke from 2011 where there's like Ricardo Fuller uh, Sam Wills is it, is it, is it what the Sam Wills the Sam Wills that the, the striker Cameron Jerome bro yeah, Crouch, Ryan Shaw, Cross, Rory, Dilap, special thing along the front. He cannot do it, bro. And it's, bro, Stoke is a million. Hey, people who live in Stoke, bro, I'm sorry, boy, but it's a miserable place, bro. Imagine turning up there to play football on a Wednesday in the cold rainy night, on a special on a Wednesday, bro. It's nah, you, you tell us if can't do that, fam. Tell us if can't do that, bro. When you got guys like Memphis Depay, Rafael Leal, Alfonso Davis out here rapping, fam, and dancing, bro. <laughs> She cannot do that, G. She cannot do it in a cold night rainy. A cold rainy night in Stoke, G. No, 100%. Uh, <laughs> Jamie just replied back and said, You're just mad that, <laughs> that Taylor Swift would have won a 50 50 against Emperor Chan. <laughs> Imagine Taylor Swift would have won a 50 50 Emperor Chan, G. <laughs> <laughs> this guy said Taylor might take the W <laughs> I'd pay good money to see that bro I'd pay good money to see that G <laughs> right <laughs> uh, Steve goes everyone can run and kick balls I love to see Taylor Swift pull this off G bro that goal fam, that run out of bad cricket I, I remember where I was bro I was, I was in a pub with my friends watching it and when it scored that I was just screaming G like bro I, I, I'd love to see Taylor Swift right pull off a basket kick in the Champions League knockout stages, right, against Juventus, bro, especially like away as well at the Juventus stage, but I forgot what the stage was called, but I, <laughs> I pay, I pay good money to see that, bro, I pay good money to see that, bro, uh, anyway, yeah, right, literally, these guys, uh, <laughs> these guys more, cre more creative than 99% of modern artists, I agree, fam, when you look at modern artists, right, like right now, again, then people, bro, call me wrong for this but the amount of songs right like on the, the the old songs that have been sampled by the modern day artists like when you look at guys like jack harlow um the um first class song that 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 song was done by fergie fam the by fergie the the, the, the girl <laughs> not alex ferguson <laughs> the girl that used to be in the uh, black eyed peas bro 
Like, there's, there's so many things that's been reused, like in music, music artists doing each other over them, like <laughs> copywriting <laughs> each other's songs, bro. So, so many of them, bro, I have got no ideas. They even use ghostwriters, fam. They, they, they literally have somebody write li lyrics for them, G. He, do, do, do you think that Modric has somebody right how he, right how he, he's gonna write his play style for him? Do you think somebody, right, can write how Lionel Messi plays football for him, bro? Get out of here, G. Get out of here, fam. You know what I mean, fam? Crazy. And then someone's got sense. This guy, right, he's a musician, by the way. He says, as a full time musician, I completely disagree. Sports provide local e economy jobs infrastructure community nothing like uh what 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 music provides also uh the the bias here of weighing in on the intellectual prowess of of of, of, of athletes versus mu musicians is maybe the stupidest thing i've ever heard shout out to um into it over it bro this guy's very fine as well shout out to this guy g you know what i mean like especially when the when the world cup comes as well like that i think i'm sure that the world cup in qatar generated i think it's like 7.6 billion guys i'm just trying to remember but it was in the billions to how much it, it generated but like the, the amount that the world cup does right for especially like nations like south africa as well when the uh because because my family's part of south african as well like when when the world cup comes like there's always jobs for people like there's there's, there's, there's always things popping off and it, it always gives people like chances as well like to actually be found and meet other people people from from different places bro and again like to, like attacking the intellectual like prowess again of the athletes g it's crazy like you know how many clever athletes there is man but even like in basketball and bro in especially like in uh, Again, like just a little side topic, but especially like in, in American football, like a quarterback fan, do you know how many plays that this guy has to remember to, uh, like, the, especially the offensive line to who's running where, like, where this person should stop in the bro? It's crazy, fam. Even in football, in tactics as well, knowing when to go, knowing when to stop, when knowing when that person's gonna make the run, predicting where that person's gonna end up, fam. Like, it's absolutely hard, and this person just wants to be, oh, they, they, and that's what. Uh, they, they look at me. Do, 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 do. I think I'm smart, but you know, fam. Absolutely ridiculous, G. Absolutely ridiculous, fam. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but I want to save this one, bro. It's came with me, fam. It's like, I, I, ask Ed Sheeran to, to put his Europa League medal on the table, fam. Where is it, bruh? <laughs> and it's Memphis Dubai, fam. Man like Memphis, bro. This guy rapping, fam. I tell you what, though. Memphis Dubai needs to work in his football. Now he's rapping the moment. You know what I mean? But <laughs> where's, where's, where's Ed's Europa League medal, fam? Where is it, bro? <laughs> Where is it, bro? When I seen that, G, I was asked. <laughs> that had me creasing. That I, I actually had me creasing. I, I'd like to see Taylor Swift try to break down the Joseph Marino's 4 2 3 1 low block <laughs> of what she has gone 1 0 down in the first 10 minutes. <laughs> That's the best one, bro. That's the best one, fam. Bro, two, was it 2015? I think it's 2015 when Chelsea lost with the Premier League, right? With the Matic, um, Schurler, Diego Costa, Hazard, Mourinho team, bro. Like, <laughs> good luck trying to break them down, bro. Like, whenever they score from, when I heard from, you ain't scoring again. You're not scoring, bro. Like, that Mourinho's low block, fam. Mr. Park the bus, bro. I'd I, I like to see, I'd like to see Turner Swift actually try to come up with solutions for that, bro. You can give her Lewandowski. You can give her Haaland, bro. You can give her De Bruyne energy, Modric, fam. He's <laughs> never breaking down that, fam. Whenever Mourinho went ahead. Oh. <laughs> Man, shutting up shop. Parking the bus. You ain't going through, G. Oh, that's the best tweet, bro. That's checking the best tweet, fam. <laughs> Marino's 4231. Oh. <laughs> Ryan goes, is Taylor Swift top of the Premier League? <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think so, mate. Nap. <laughs> Nap. <laughs> she ain't, bro. She ain't, fam. Oh, these guys kill me. <laughs> of course, if you have asked the fans that say this, bro. <laughs> of course, I'm an Arsenal fan, bro. This absolutely killed me, bro. Oh, <laughs> uh, and the final tweet to, 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 end, it, to end this one off, guys. Uh, and it comes from D. And they say, anyone can put words on the page. Anyone can kick a ball. Music is about in interpretation. Winners are decided by opinion. 
football is about scorelines winner are decided on merit it's still possible to find both important and i agree both are important like football players generally do listen to music before um they like like they uh, arrive to the what stadium that they will play that game they listen to music during the change room they, they, they listen to music sometimes even when they're warming up bro so like so music is a very important thing in in, in humanity and in life I, I, I i'm not i'm not downgrading music whatsoever bro i'm not bro but yeah fam. and then they, in football like winners like it, 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 especially in sport bro if you're the best right like the best win fam there's no losers bro there's no losers bro like if, if, if like if, if you're going up against each other team versus team right may the best team win fam that's what it is bro and, and it's all on merit fam the, the, the better person wins that's what it is on, 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 unless they're bribed then, then they have a four in the game but anyway guys that's been the video man like i am really sick i am really sick and thank you so much for the people that have stuck, <laughs> stuck around for this i really love these twitter uh, videos that i make because people online just crack me up and i uh, and i always laugh and i and i always like having a laugh guys you know but yeah man like this this illness is killing me I, i've got a cold that's why i'm drinking the tea that's why i'm taking the, the paracetamol at the moment guys but yeah I've been Princeton, guys, reacting, reading, laughing at this whole Taylor Swift and football conundrum, guys. Music versus <laughs> music versus sport, guys. But, yeah, it's been a fun video. If you do like this, don't, don't forget to subscribe and like the video, guys. I'm signing out. Keep it real. Peace. Yeah.